Hello everyone, welcome back again. Today we are going to create a basic 2D floor plan with a ViaCAD 12 software. Okay, first you can create new drawings. In here we can change for uh, units. You can click files, click preference, and go to units menu. You can change unit in here. I will use in millimeter. Click OK. The next we can create walls. You can click this tools Alt and choose this multi wall. I will click at this point. We can move to the right here. I will set four lengths into four thousand. You can scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out. Next, move to the top five thousand. Okay, move uh, to the left. You can set into four thousand. And then you can move to the bottom here, 5,000. You can press escape button to close. You throw it again from in the end point in here, in middle point. You can move to the bottom here, 2,000. Move to direct, you can click at this point. The next, you can press from middle point in here to the bottom here. You can select uh, at uh, this wall. Use a selection tool, click at this point. And you can press the left button. The next, we can insert windows. You can click again at these tools and choose window. You can set dimension in here. You can click at this point with this wall and click again in here. So it will be create window. To move, you can use selection tools and select this window. You can move in another area. Like I will move into this point. We can create again for door with this tool. You can set dimension in here. Okay, I will select uh, this wall. Click again and I will move into here. The next we create again in this wall. Okay, and then you can create in here. Now you can use move tools to move uh, this door. You can move again to this point. Okay, very easy. You also can move uh, in here to the left. Hand. Okay, the next uh, we can insert text into this floor plan. So you can use a text tool here. You can click and to change text height, you can click a modify, click text in here, you can change in here for text height. And to apply, you only select at this point. The next we can set for the name into room one. So this text to bigger. To edit, you can uh, double click, and now we can change user in here. We set into 200, so this for 200, and we can set into black, and you can close. The next, we can move to this point, center point. Okay. To copy, you can select the object and press Ctrl button hold, so it will be automatically copy. We copy again to drag it. To change, you can double click. Just this tool, text, and I will set in here into room 3. The next, you can select again this text, you can change into room 2. You can click apply for room 3. You can set in here and click apply. Click close. Now, to set a dimension, you can use this tool, dimension. You can set into first uh, horizontal dimension and for uh, Settings, you can click the dimension, click value, you can settings in here, like you can change arrow format, size, I will use 50, and expression gap 40, and 300 for fill first offset. To apply, you only click on the end point in here, middle point, click, then you can sort again at this point, to here. We can move from right to left, or you can move from top to the bottom. So you can click from this point and from this point. Oh, sorry, in here we need to use vertical dimension. So I will uh, undo. So we can change in here into vertical from top to the bottom. So you can zoom in and click from this point to here. This uh, for vertical. You can click again from the end point in here into this point. Okay, the next you can click 
from top sorry here we can click from this point and can click again into here okay, so it will be correct in uh, this point at the top in here we can use horizontal dimension is for horizontal we can set from this point okay you can click from the left to the right if you want to crack in the top dimension okay. in the bottom you can crack from the right to the left okay you can click again from this point into here and then we can click from this point into this point okay the next in here we can set from the bottom so you can set from this point we can change into vertical dimension you can sort and then you can click in here the next from this point you can set into here the last from uh, the bottom here and then you can click at uh, this point okay now finally we can use uh, hedge tools to crack out in a wall you can click this tool hedge now you can change spacing in here i will set into 30 for spacing now you can select at uh, this point so it will be automatically correct hedge you also can click at this point okay the next uh, you can close use uh, the selection tools these fan tools to drag this uh, area object okay now we already correct uh, this uh, simple 3d model for pen in viacat 12 if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video